Well, there's only one way to find out. We're going to race a bike against a supercar over a three-quarter mile straight. We've got every big boy's dream car, the Porsche 911 GT3 RS, up against a Honda Farblade, today's most popular superbike. Don't forget the Porsche will set you back ten times as much money as the two-wheeled wonder. Driving the Porsche, Daytona 24-hour winner Johnny Molem and on the bike, Maria Costello, the fastest woman ever round the Isle of Man TT course. He won't have much of a chance. Everyone tells me I'm going to get beaten. I'm sure he knows that already too. But I'm going to do my best to make sure that doesn't happen. Bikes just have a greater acceleration than most cars, even sports cars. 380 horsepower. It will be faster 0 to 60. 4.1 0 to 60. I'm sure he's ready to take the defeat on the chin. Boys, Maria was right. After three quarters of a mile, both the bike and the car were travelling at 180 miles an hour. The difference was in the acceleration. Let's take another look. In the slightly damp conditions, the bike struggled to get all its power down onto the road. The car got greater initial traction, but its weight worked against it. But this is when the bike's superior acceleration really shows. Remember, the car accelerates twice as quickly as most fast road cars, but the Fireblade is making it look like a milk float. It's getting silly now. The bike is already in top gear, nearing its top speed of over 180 miles an hour. The car, trailing in its wake, is still piling on the speed in a vain attempt to catch up. Now watch the clock. Three and a half seconds difference, that's a lifetime. The bike crossed the line at its top speed, around 180 miles an hour. The car crossed the line at the same speed. If the race carried on, the car's higher top speed of 190 miles an hour would allow it to catch up, but that would take a straight a lot longer than this one. So, pound for pound, you'll never beat a bike for performance. Don't ever let that Michael Schumacher wannabe next door tell you his Mini Cooper is the fastest thing on the road. The Fireblade makes 170 bhp and is one-fifth the weight of a Mini. So the bike will do 0 to 60 in less than two and a half seconds and will top 180 miles an hour. Woof!